My name is Tao Xiangli. I come from China's Anhui Province. This is my homemade submarine. It's six and a half meters long and weighs 800 kilograms. It's got a periscope, pressure gauges, a compass, a propeller, and an oxygen supply. Many of the parts used in the submarine were purchased at a second-hand market. It's cheaper to buy parts from the market, and this eases the pressure on my own finances. I always prepare and test everything before I launch the submarine in the water. For example, I reinstall the periscope and I check the oxygen supply every time. Now I'm installing a monitoring device. It's similar to a periscope and it rotates 360 degrees. The 34-year-old amateur inventor Tao was born into a poor peasant family. He had to drop out of primary school after less than five years because his family could not afford the fees. Tao loves inventing. He works the night shift at a karaoke bar, freeing up his days to work on new inventions. All his earnings go to his creations, and he scours local second-hand markets for cheap parts. Tao's previous inventions include a massaging hair washer and a shoe polishing machine. But while he has managed to get 17 out of some 50 inventions patented, none have brought him money or fame. Tao wanted to build the submarine because he thinks it's something few others have done. It took him two years and cost him nearly five thousand dollars. He hopes the submarine can help him attract a financial backer so that he can pursue his dream of being a full-time inventor. A reservoir might be a playground for some, but for Tao, it's where he tests his homemade submarine. I think it's very interesting. I didn't expect to see a submarine in the middle of the reservoir. Tao is creative. He's very persistent as well. I saw him launch the submarine to the reservoir during winter last year when it was cold. If I were him, I would have given up. <laughs> At least I've tried. You never know what results you're going to get until after you actually make things happen. This is a way that I'm trying to prove myself, and hopefully people will find me to help me. <laughs>